डॉक्टर अब ज्योति यस सर हाँ वी कैन स्टार्ट आई थिंक इट्स ओके ओके सर एक्चुअली ओनली थर्टी एट पार्टिसिपेंट सर देयर मे बी दे विल जॉइन कैन वी वेट फॉर एलिस्ट टू थ्री मिनट्स ओके सर ओके प्रधान सर एक दो मिनट वेट कर लेते हैं ठीक है सर ठीक है ठीक है लंच ब्रेक था देयर दैट्स व्हाई मेनी हैज लेफ्ट आर्डियर इट वाज मोर देन अराउंड 150 60 लाइक दैट वे आर अटेंडिंग यस सर ओके वी डू वेट टू अनदर 5 मिनट्स नो प्रॉब्लम यस यस थैंक यू सर थैंक यू सर बस लंच ब्रेक वाज हियर ओके रेजिस्टर <laughs> प्रेजेंट नाम डिजाइन एक्टर अच्छी तरह करेस्पिंग पैटर्न एक्टर प्रधान सर जस्ट फॉर टाइम बिंग म्यूट योर सेल्फ सर ठीक है नो प्रॉब्लम ठीक है सर ठीक है सर हाँ मैं तो दूसरा काम कर रहा है ठीक ठीक है 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 सर सर कंपैरिजन कर ले करिया ना नहीं क्लियर एनी अदर इलेक्ट्रिक कॉल
Lali sir, let us start. Yes, yes. Okay, sir. So, uh, welcome to all our coordinator, joint coordinator, our uh, respected speaker, as well as the participants in this uh, post lunch session. That is the last session of today's this one day national seminar on IPR and its related issues. In this particular session, we are we are very much fortunate to have Dr. J.K. Pradhan sir, Deputy Controller of Patent and Designs, IPO Kolkata. Sir has done his uh, PhD from Institute of Mineral and Material Technology, IMMT, Council of Scientific and Industrial Research, CSIR Bhubaneswar. He attended the European Patent Office and the Netherlands and Munich, Germany in 2007, Japan Patent Office at Tokyo 2011. He has also led Indian delegation in 41st and of ACT meeting uh, held at Wipro, Geneva. He is currently taking the charges of design wing, registration of design application, prosecution or hearing of design application and any other related issues with design application. So, sir will give a uh, talk on industrial design, a marketing tool for industry. Pradhan sir, you can continue sir. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. At the outset, I once again extend my sincere thanks to organizer of today's seminar, especially Professor Dr. Lalit Kumar Singh, uh, Dean of School of Engineering and Technology, Mizoram University, and uh, Professor Dr. Premnath, HNB, Garwal University, Uttarakhand, for giving me this opportunity to share my experience in inter on intellectual property with you all. Next couple of minutes, I will just say, speak about I will speak about the importance of uh, industrial designs and definitions. Some definition I will uh, discuss. Relevant provisions of the Act, Designs Act 2000. Prohibition of uh, certain designs, that means uh, which are registrable, which are not registrable. Then filing formalities, the where to file, what are the documents required, and uh, what type of uh, examination and uh, prosecution are taken place in design office. All details I will cover. Then a uh, classification and a search. And what are the international arrangements by which uh, one can file a design application in India? And similarly, an Indian uh, resident can file abroad. And uh, last one is the piracy of registered designs. Then, before coming to discuss uh, my topic, industrial designs, marketing tool for industry, I will uh, give some idea about uh, intellectual property. I think. Uh, my colleague, Dr. A.J. Sao, already covered about patents, but I will give just a glance about it. The intellectual property means the property of the mind, and that is which is created by the human intellect. And like other properties, tangible property like land, vehicle, and uh, etc., this is one day property has great economic significance in knowledge based economy and society and has with human creativity and in inventiveness ip is all around us every product or services that we use in our daily lives is the result of long chain of big or small invention for example if you take if you take an example bulb point pen after invention by this was invented by hungarian uh, news uh, Paper editor, Laszlo Bedo, a Hungarian newspaper who invented ballpen pen long back. And after that, many types of improved version of the ballpen pen are available in the market. Either some uh, it technology improved and aesthetic aspect also improved. That design part of it is also improved. 
So, intellectual property is created by not only a, a member scientist, member write, writer or composer, and any ordinary person having innovative skill can invent something. And this innovation or creation or any uh, creation by human intellect can be managed in a proper manner, should be managed in a proper manner, so that ultimate optimum benefits should, should be shared with the society. The protection of IP, that intellectual property, in a legal framework is called intellectual property rights. IPR provides incentive to innovators, creators, as well as, as, well as industry and institution where the person works. Or The IPR system protect, protects the innovators or creators or designers from imitation and dissemination of existing information and knowledge as a means of to facilitate invention activities and innovation for benefit of society by creating some new things. Either it may be in form of uh, writing, singing, painting, or any innovate, innovation, technological invest, innovation, or aesthetic creation. It all covers about the IP. And I will give some examples for the, and what are the product of mine? Here I have uh, given an illustration of TV. It has uh, written as Sony. The name by which it is sellable in market is covered in the trademark. So trademark deals with the mark or name by which a product can be sellable in a market. And the instruction manual that we are, uh, we get generally uh, while I purchase uh, television, any electronics item or any um, um, household items. The instruction manual is or instruction given in the manual protected under copyright. And you know, technology by which television operates is covered under under the patents right and at last that we discuss i will discuss the all details about it the aesthetic part how a television looks like while a customer purchases a television and uh, enters the television showroom he'll first see the how it looks by seeing the article even if it's sony tv lg tv some so many branded products are there by looking that article, if it appeals to his eye, even if technology may be more, uh, may be more or less the same, so he attracted the aesthetic the beauty of the product, beauty of the, that uh, design of the television. And that is covered under the design night. A design night is nothing but the aesthetic view of the TV set, either in color combination or shape or ornamentation. During my lecture, I will discuss about some non-statutory definition as well as statutory definition as per the design chart. So this is definition of non-legal, non-statutory definition. That is, industrial designs is one of the category of IPR where design system focuses the aesthetic feature of an article derived from its visual appearance. Relevant aspects are shape, configuration, surface pattern, color, line, or color combination thereof as applied to an article which produces an aesthetic impression on the sense of sight. In first, uh, first of the uh, seminar, you have already uh, aware of the patents. I will give some uh, difference between, basic difference between patent and designs. And sometimes people are confused about what is patent and sometimes they are uh, called as a design patent because in uh, some countries they call it as a design patent but here in India we call it patent and designs and uh, patents covers protection of for any new innovation either in the product or process involving inventive steps and having industrial application whereas design protection of ten for any new or original new or original I will define or any details of second slides any new or original shape, configuration, surface ornamentation or pattern, color combination, 
applied industrially to any article and thereby finish article would be appealed to i and what is the finish article i will uh, define all details and during my uh, presentation you may ask uh, in type of question and uh, second point difference patents deals with the technical features of the article product or machine or any process either product or process whereas design does not deal with any technical or functionality feature of the article third different basic difference patents needs a elaborate description that is description drawing claims and the manner at which it perform all details has to be mentioned along with a claim set of claims for design is very simple and it needs only photograph sketches of that or sketches of that article or computer graphics and no detailing is required only photograph with a statement of novelty and disclaimer now one of my uh, uh, question may come to the mind so what is the need of we will get the patent what is the need of the design so design Sorry. Uh, the importance of design it makes a product look attractive and appealing to customer and may even be its unique selling point if design is better then it has a unique selling point it can be sell uh, can be sold in a higher price and protect the appearance of your product against copying by registering or getting the design right one can sue the infringer and one can get the rights like any other rights property rights one can get the right by which it can infringe or sue against the infringer and by mere changing the aesthetic feature of the article it adds the value of the product and by registering the design right fair return on invest one can the investment uh, the amount invested to carry out the product and uh, technology as well as aesthetic part and good return will be will get one can get a good return and it is a bit no doubt a business asset and it in by uh, getting the design right legal design legal right one it increases a fair competition among the competitors so there is a quotation in time magazine that is i already gave example there is in market so many branded tv television are available and when technology and everything is same that when companies are competing at equal price and functionality the only difference is the design the design is the only differential that matters and it is the product is sellable by seeing the appealing the article of article so now question come to mind is it necessary to register the design one may say uh, you know because uh, in some countries they don't have uh, the registration system and some countries have uh, both on register design and register designs but in india there is a the provision of register designs and only uh, the registration and design the one cannot get a right legal right so anyone can copy that design and sell in high price or manufacture the product to protect that to protect a new or original design applied to any article which is a creation of human intellect by web registration one can get a legal right number 2 to prevent the imitation or commercial exploitation of innovative design without prior consent of proprietor or originator so by uh, registering one can get through agnesting etc third point one can up to obtain a reward by commercializing suppose i uh, i have created a new design but i, I don't have any uh, enough money to set up a, a factory or a industry so that i can license or assign my right to other so that i will get some money so these are three points basic points by which design right registration design is better to get a legal right is is necessary since uh, we are dealing with the legal right def definitely some act and rules is there i am giving uh, some uh, gist of the act and rules of designs in next slides and uh, this slides is the historical background of of the design legislation in india 
first it was enacted in 1872 during colonial rule that uh, is called patents and designs protection act and 1888 innovation and designs act that also before independence and uh, designs at, uh, indian patents and designs act 1911 before the independence and that continued up to 2000 so post independence designs act uh, uh, enacted in the year 2000 and came into force 2001 and designs rule followed by designs rule 2001 and designs rule further amended in 2008 2014 to incorporate small entity small and medium enterprises and recently we have amended designs rules 2021 effective from 25 january 2021 to include startup and they also by local classification the this is this about some uh, section and rules i will not uh, discuss details while i discuss this there are 48 sections 48 rules some section i'll discuss which are relevant and five schedules schedule one is fees the total 28 entries different types of fees is there uh, list of form uh, schedule two list of forms schedule three list classification of goods schedule four cost allowable in proceeding before the controller schedule five certificate of registration now coming to definition legal definition under the act i will discuss the definition of article definition of design then definition of uh, original definition of set one by one i will discuss with an example so article under section 2 of design act defines any article of manufacture and any substance which is artificial or partly artificial partly natural that means natural articles are not eligible for registration are not covered under section 2 of the design act and includes part of the article being made and sold separately here one broken bottle is given and with a bottle with a cap small bottle with a cap here if you see the left side left side left hand side that is a broken bottle so part of the article the second part of the definition of article that is it includes part of the article being made and sold separately the part of article not necessary broken bottle we cannot get a broken piece of bottle in market so it is not vendible product so it is not qualifying definition of design but in the right hand side the bottle with a cap so either we get a bottle with cap fitted with cap that's okay no problem or a bottle as such we can get uh, and a cap separately because both are vendible product can be obtained from the market so an article which is artificial or partly artificial part natural and it, and also it the article includes in any part of the article which capable of being made and sold separately qualifying definition of article now coming to the definition of design section 2d of the design act is a legal de definition and uh, here only one paragraph is mentioned so i'll uh, in uh, three way i'll represent it the design means what is the feature feature of shape configuration pattern ornament composition of lines or colors applied to any article article already de defined previous slide that means these are feature of design the what are the features shape configuration pattern ornament composition lines or colors applied to any article how it is applied uh, the article the article may be two dimensional three dimensional two dimensional sari three dimensional is refrigerator so article may be two dimensional three dimensional and when these features apply to any article by how it is applied by any industrial process or means whether it mechanical manual chemical separate combine which is finished article appeal to and just sold by the eye this is for this first paragraph the definition of design and the de definition of applied to article and how it is applied different industrial process and means and last line finished article appeal to and just 
solely by I. So I am giving this, uh, this uh, explaining this first paragraph with examples, then I will return again this uh, slide. Yes. So the first uh, definition of the article that is design means shape, configuration, ornamentation. So first consider the shape configuration. You see, this is a three dimensional article, flower pot having same article having different shape. So it qualifying the definition of article as the design. So different design is, we can see different designs. So different form of shape of, or different form of shape can be protected. Next, pattern. This I have given one uh, some picture of um, car having different color combination as well as pattern. So design means shape, configuration, pattern, surface or surface ornamentation. Here surface ornamental also there. So it definitely it can qualify definition design design as well as article. Yes. That is another thing I, we have noticed that should be appeal to eye. That is article or design should be noticeable by the eye. So this is example of sugar grain, grain of sugar. So those, those, uh, there is the grains of so many grains, but we cannot, the exact shape or configuration of the grain is not noticeable, not visible. So it is not qualifying the definition of design as well as article. It most noticeable to I. But if we take a sugar cube, so it is easily identifiable having definite shape and configuration. So sugar cube can be qualifying definition of design and article because it noticeable appeal to I as well as a uh, artificial manifestation. Now coming to set of so here it is single piece, either single piece uh, of grain we can uh, take or the refrigerator, for example, shape. So single article can be protected and qualifying definition of design as the article. But now come to the mind, whether it is single article will allow or, or the group of article can be filed in the application. Yes, one can file group of articles if there is a condition, if it is set. Set means number of articles of same general character, number of articles of same general character and originally sold together and intended to be used together, and all bearing the same design with or without modification, not sufficient to alter the character or substantially to affect the identity of the Arab. That means the group of articles, if it's sold together and having general character, same general character, it can be considered as a set not individual article, but group of articles, what it is in set. For example, I'm giving coffee set, dinner set, set of cup links and tie clip, set of smoking accessory, tea set, coffee set, set of table knives, forks and spoons, set of furniture for drawing room, set of air conditioners, set of uh, sofa covers, sorry, set seat cover for automobiles, and set of audio, audio visual items. So it is can be sold together, I mean, say general, same general character. Hence, it qualifying, even if it is more than one article, but it can be commonly sold, it qualifying definition of set. Now, return to the uh, definition of slides of uh, definition of design. That is, we have already have covered what is shape, configuration, pattern, ornament, composition of lines, colors, Apply to any article in two dimensional, three dimensional, by any industrial process already covered, and thus solely, which is finished article, sugar, sugar cube already have discussed, solely, uh, and thus solely by the eye. But here the definition of designs, also it does not include, design does not include any mode or principle of construction of and anything which is mere uh, mechanical device, for example, screw. Surface pattern of a screw, a, a group pattern of the screw. This is a mechanical, mere mechanical device. So it has to be disclaimed. 
because design does not cover the mechanical functionality operation part of the article so one has to disclaim i will give you uh, in the latter slides how to write uh, out is it printed on sheet having writing a novel statement and disclaimer while claiming something one has to disclaim mechanical aspect as well as does not include any trademark if is some trademark appearing in the article that has to be um, disclaimed and any property mark or any letter words on the copyright act that has to be disclaimed so disclaimer has to be given while claiming the novelty so mechanical aspect one has to disclaim because it is not a design and uh, does not include property mark as defined in the, uh, section 479 of ipc indian penal code so what is property mark a mark used for denoting a movable property belongs to a particular person is called property mark it means marking of any movable article or goods or package receptacles containing goods etc with any mark therein is comes under purview of the property mark for example mark used by the indian railway on their goods may be termed as a property mark for purpose of easy identification of owner similarly it does not include the design should not be any artistic work because it is covered under the copyright law copyright act 1957 and uh, artistic work means any painting sculpture drawings engraving or photographs or any work of architecture that is comes under copyright does not include but there is a overlap copyright and uh, designs that on registrable design art, design articles that means any article which can be registered under design right but not registered and uh, the applicant does not want to uh, apply or he, we apply later so he can get a um, copyright on that design under section 15 of the copyright act but there is a uh, uh, limitation if the that design manufacture more than 50 times the copyright losses now this is a general definition of the design under section 2d of the design act now i will i will discuss what are non registered designs so designs shall not register if the design is not new or original and its second second point it has been disclosed to public before filing anywhere in india or in the world before filing the design application or it is not significantly distinguishable from the known designs or combination of known designs or it comprises or contains scandalous or obscene matter and another point in section 51 if it is put into public order morality i'll discuss so i'll give the examples and discuss one by one first one is not new or original in original means originated from author of the such design that mean new creation or it includes in our design act new creation or new application literary or dictionary meaning is new creation of design definition is new creation but as for the art new creation is okay no problem but if new application is there that means includes cases which are which do all in themselves but yet new in their application if the new application that also qualifying original that new or original that means new creation or new application of even if it is old design and i will give you example yes the design which is not new as as such but original and new in application also registrable for example shape of cricket ball bat and ball is already known but if if somebody apply or applicant applies same design of shape of cricket and ball with a chocolate 
So played in the shape of cricket and a bat, cricket bat and ball. That qualifying definition of original. Similarly, it is there in the shape of cricket bat and ball. If not prior published, it can also be. Though it is shape is already known. You see, in patents, no, here no in, innovativeness, inventive uh, inventive step is here because already known. Cricket bat and ball already already known. He has just applied the uh, eraser eraser with shape of cricket bat and ball. In case of patent, it will not be because patent involves te uh, technicality and uh, functionality. It does, but here patent will not granted because lack of inventive steps. But in designs, as per design act, even if it is old, here application is new. Even if not inventive, but application is new, hence it is allowed. Adjustable. Number uh, third point, it has been disclosed to public anywhere in India or the world in form of by way of publication, tangible form or by use or any other way prior to the filing date or where is applicable prior to date. The second criteria, it should not be published prior to filing. So here I have given uh, one example that applicants design uh, has filed a, a hexagonal coil, mosquito coil. For the cited one, already there is a published um, mosquito coil having same shape and configuration. So it is a prior publish. Is there any citation? The design cannot be registered. Number third point, it cannot be registrable. Design not registrable if it is not significantly distinguishable from known designs or combination of known designs. Either that is more than citation can be given here. And I will give uh, two examples here. Yes. The applicant design a bottle. And the cited design in 2000, this 2004. Here, if you see the neck part, everything identical. So no significant distinguishable. If you compare side by side two bottles, one cannot, except the cap. But uh, in this case, uh, the applicant does not claim the cap, and he claimed the safe compression of the bottle as, as a totality. So it lacks. It does not qualify section C that does not sing significantly distinguishable from known designs. So 4C it is not registrable. Under section 4C not registrable. I am giving another example. It is a beam, safe configuration of a beam. If another applicant, it suppose register, and another applicant after uh, one or two years or some, after some years, he file an application which increase the length or breadth of this beam and number of holes of that mentioned here or if we increase one or two holes here in between. So if we compare this beam with uh, applicants design with little bit uh, broader, so in that case, it does not qualifying section C, 4C of the design sir, that is not significantly distinguishable. To be registrable or registrable design, design to be registrable, it must have a significant distinguishable from the known design. And number fourth point, it comprises a contains scandalous and obscene matter, it does not qualify. I cannot be registered under design act. Besides this, section four, non registrability of the designs, another that is it is against public order morality. For example, Goddess Durga. If somebody makes a coin or key, key ring, you can say, a key, I mean, shape of Goddess Durga. So it is not registered because Goddess Durga, any single person does not have the monopoly of Goddess Durga. And it hurts the sentiment of a particular religious community. Similarly, Ganesh shape, Lord Ganesh shape uh, uh, bottle. So it cannot be registered because it against public order morality because it hurts the sentiment of a particular community. So under section 5.1, it is not registrable if it against the public order morality. And each design has to be uh, classic classified 
and uh, India follows local classification system that is the uh, international classification system for uh, industrial designs and uh, here there are 32 classes and uh, and each class is for the subdivided depending on the article, nature of the article each class has to, uh, the article has to put in a particular class and uh, we are coming to the definitional part I have covered now coming to the formalities the procedural part that we are following in design office and uh, how the design application can be filed and where to file what documents needed what type of fees that we paid and uh, how it is uh, prosecuting in the uh, design office all details I will discuss in coming slides that is pre-registration activities and post-registration activities Now, after knowing the design, what is design, what is article, what is the original, any uh, person can interested to file an application. Now, he will be confused on who can file application, where to file, and what type of documents needed, how to prepare a representation sheet, and what rights he get after the obtaining the design, design right. Everything I will discuss. Now, coming to who can file design application. Any person can file, the person includes individual or nat natural person, a legal entity, legal representative or deceased person can file a design application. And where to file? Either there are two types of way one can file application, either electronically, online filing system, we have, and uh, it, it can file 24-7, but uh, the user need must have a DSC, the digital signature certificate. And uh, in other way, you can file. You can file. Uh, we have the four offices in India, patent offices, for design office only at Calcutta. And uh, you can file physical paper documents in uh, either Delhi, Mumbai, Chennai, and Calcutta also. So, but the documents submitted at uh, patent office Delhi, then that's Mumbai and Chennai, after uh, receiving documents, New application in these three offices, they transmit to the Calcutta office. Calcutta office will digitize the application and for the processing starts. And at present, more than 83%, around 83% application we are receiving online mode, and only 17, 15 to 17% we are receiving on physical mode, that is paper documents. And in Calcutta, Kolkata, patent office, examination, registration, publication. All post registration activities are carried out. The certificate, everything are being carried out at Kolkata Design Office. And what are documents needed? Which will be submitted along with application form. The design application to file a design application in India is very simple. It requires very simplified form and uh, very few documents are needed first one is application fees sorry application form uh, form one and the form one that is gives uh, the bibliography the applicant's name nationality legal status address 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 for service in india class number name of the article priority if it is a reciprocal arrangement by that means if the applicant is from other countries other than India, if he takes the priority from that country, he has to submit uh, give details of priority data and a priority document he has needs to submit submitted and prior registration data he has to give and signature date. There is one page for he has to give the all details of that. And uh, up, uh, this up, along with form one, two representation sheet depicting various views of the article. Generally, article views various. Uh, Depends upon the nature of the article. For textile article, the two views are front view, back view. For the refrigerator, it can be seven view maximum. That is top view, bottom view, left side view, right side view, front view, back view, and prospective view as such. But it depends on the article. Article how can be illustrated on a piece of paper. Or if you call it a representation sheet. So if it is three, four, 
for example uh, textile article uh, sari it is front to and back though so two sets one set means for example i'm give i'll give uh, in better, better example in a subsequent slide because there is how to write a um, novel statement already there so i will explain there and uh, third point is uh, power of attorney if it is filed through any uh, patent agents or advocates it need to be so my form 21 but here which it must uh, must be stamped as per indian stamp act in many times applicants or advocates or advocates and patent agents they are not affixing the appropriate stamp it uh, must be form 21 along with the appropriate stamp should be affixed and prior documents already uh, discussed that if it is reciprocal application if it is other than indian application wants to get priority from that country he need to give submit the priority documents and assignment if it is priority country suppose a is the applicant but b is the creator and he has not assigned to b a b is not assigned to a then in that case he has to submit assignment documents and uh, form 24 that is small entity startup if it is a small entity as per the declaration of msme act under the msme act he has submit form 24 along with some uh, msme registration certificate and if it is startup he has submit form 24 as as well as startup certificate from dpiit and uh, if it is the um, msme or startup is it foreign entity then he has to submit the affidavit along with form 24 and at last fee is the most for the uh, msme national person and the startup fee is only 1000 rupees and other than the three categories fee is 4000 then coming to the preparation of a representation sheet the form 1 second along with the representation sheet a representation sheet it is a a4 size durable paper sheet number to mention in e sheet photographs line diagrams or computer graphics the articles should be given name of the beast to be mentioned novel statement disclaimer signature and date here given no i have given one piece uh, sample piece how to prepare a representation sheet the novelty is prospective book. one this is one p one uh, photograph one can give the top view and bottom view left side right side right side view so in that case one set means consisting all views for example this uh, water bottle teapot having a perspective he wants the applicant wants to uh, illustrate perspective view as it is as looks it then a top view bottom view for example he want to submit three uh, views so in that case one set means three set one set two set of representation set one set means three set at the perspective view one set uh, second set is the um, top view and uh, third set is bottom view so one set it, it consisting of three views perspective view top view bottom view so two sets has to be submitted and uh, while uh, representing or illustrating the article on the paper representation sheet one has to write novel statement along with disclaimer statement novel statements novel write in, in this way that is Research in the safe configuration of teapot as illustrated, or he can write novel research in the safe configuration, color combination of teapot as illustrated, or in another way one can write novel research in the safe configuration surface pattern. Here some pattern is appearing, so surface safe configuration and surface pattern of the teapot as illustrated, depending upon the article. and uh, what type of feature is appearing on the article one can claim it and uh, write novel statements then he has to write disclaimer first disclaimer should be in respect of mechanical function that is no claim is made by virtue of this registration in respect of any mechanical or other action of any mechanism whatever or in respect of any mode or principle or construction of the article this is most he has to write disclaim because under section uh, 2d definition of design i have already discussed that is while claiming feature of the design 
and uh, when applied to article yes but it does not include functionality denmark uh, denmark related articles the sorry denmark copyright or property ips indian then uh, he has to write disclaimer respect for uh, recession of trademark letter words and uh, numbers he has to disclaim then uh, here some uh, because we are facing some problems uh, while we are dealing the applications the many times many times applicants submit this type of a cross one it is not clearly legible that mobile phone having this uh, blood photographs the reprinted article should be clear photographs and clearly should be legible so cross one is a bad quality and in this case we will ask to submit a fresh reprinted sheet having legible photograph similarly here one uh, box is here storage box and in a hand drawing a line drawing he has mentioned it but not legible so it should not be like this and say center table that means a photograph should be very clear and legible now it is a single because uh, during the uh, definition of for designs i already discussed that is either single article or group of articles if it qualifying the definition of set so here three chairs for different designs there is a variation so it cannot be considered as a set but chair table is it considered as a set a pair of shoes if there is a three pieces of shoe but different designs it cannot be sold as a set because it three different piece generally so available in pair similar pair of gloves but here cross one it is not called, it cannot be called as a pair of gloves but different color different for different purpose similarly sofa with a cabinet it, it doesn't qualify in definition of set a sofa with a um, center table that can be qualified but the storage unit not considered as a set next coming to the examination part after filing the documents by uh, submitting the uh, required documents and fees it comes to the examiner examiner will search it in our database internal database and uh, free database that is like google image and uh, uh, free database of other countries and uh, at last the wipo database is searched and if there is no citation and documents in order of uh, in order or if there is some objection he will put up the controller for for the action so he will uh, check whether it is qualifying the definition of article that is 2a and whether the article def qualifying definition 2d definition of design and whether it is original and whether it is satisfied with registrable under the, uh, the act or it non registrable under the section 4 you have to check it and uh, whether it is a qualifying satisfying section 51 then public order morality yes our uh, another one is if it is free judicial the security of india under section 46 of the design act the design office will refer to drdo for their opinion after clearance from the drdo it will proceed in normal way that is it can be registered or if the drdo finds that it, it is free judicial to the security of country then it will be revoked it cannot be uh, it cannot be registered but it depends on the opinion of the drdo but design of piece will uh, forward the application for example on man vehicle or on on man airplane so in that case it might be um, required used for uh, defense of the country so the design of piece will refer to the drdo then uh, it take uh, the two dimensional three dimensional is some picture already i have given that is Textile items in all two-dimensional, chair, table, refrigerator, are three-dimensional. And this is a process of uh, processing of design application in India. That is when it is online filing or offline filing. It is numbered and dated. 
then uh, substantial examination, examination, um, examiner check the novelty, section um, that is a definition of article, definition of design, restability under different sections. Then uh, if there is objection, we'll, we'll forward it to the applicant by email as well as by the speed post. And if there is no objection, then it will directly accept it and is notified in the official journal. And now we are registering around 15 to 20 percent. There is no objection. That means documents are in order. So once it is, if so, there is some objection, we'll communicate to the applicant. Communicate, uh, applicant will get six months from date of application, not not date of uh, FR, that first exemption uh, report. In many cases, applicant misses the deadline, and uh, it, if it uh, fails to submit, then it becomes abandoned. In the last uh, uh, 10 years, I have just observed, uh, I'll get some data, that Northeast, from Northeast, we have received around 100, uh, around 100 uh, design applications out of which Assam, more applications from Assam, around uh, more than 60 applications, and uh, Manipur, around 20, around 20. But uh, I observed in Manipur some uh, uh, organization that is Mara Autonomous District Council. And he applied, uh, after apply, applying the design, he did not pursue. And uh, for some means, uh, uh, he applied the design application, I think 2016. Thereafter, design application, uh, examined application and uh, communicate the uh, disturb objection and disturb requirements, but the applicant did not submit the reply, did not submit the reply, or did not respond the reply to office action. So he loves uh, that application, so all application, I think 10 to 15 application, oh, deemed to be an order, so if you uh, fail to submit the reply within six months or uh, there is a provision, another extension for another three months, but the extension should be prior to expiry of six months from date of publication. So if fails to do so, then it will becomes non-compliant, that is abandoned. And if submits, then it again examines, examined by the examiner, and if all objections are compliant, then accepted, notified in the journal. And at last it will be entered in instead of design. And uh, if non-compliance, then uh, controller will offer hearing. Now we are offering personal he hearing due to COVID, we have stopped it. And we are uh, offering hearing on telephone as well as VC hearing. And, and if he, he fails to, he contest, if you comply all the objections during hearing, they will be accepted and uh, notified and certificate will be issued. And if he contested and uh, the applicant does not make any amendments or comply the objection or during the hearing, then uh, or it, after that, after hearing, post hearing, written submission, the case is refused and this refusal he may apply appeal to the, before the High Court. And if the High Court uh, disallows the controller decision, then again it will be examined and, and uh, accepted and notified. And uh, if con uh, High Court, Honorable High Court, Appeal the decision, then it will be refused. This is uh, after uh, registration of designs. We are publishing every Friday, every week, we are publishing more than 200 application uh, registered designs under Section C, that is in like patents. Uh, in patents, either only publication, if the applicant requests for Form 9 for only publication of the application, or it automatically publishes after 18 months. But here, no only publication, that only publication or prior publication before registration. Only it will publish to open to public once it is published after, sorry, registered. So after registration, it will open to public. So in publication, we have given best view of the article, then uh, some bibliographic data. And uh, certificate will be issued to um, register proprietor. This is uh, one form of, sorry, example of certificate we have issued. That is uh, one Compton Gris Limited, one uh, machine is here. Yes. So it is uh, now we are sent by, it is being sent by 
speed question only as per the requirement of the act once a certificate uh, is received the uh, register proprietor has the obligation to mark as a registered design either he can write register uh, register design with design number or he can write uh, regd with design number or he can write rd with design number so that the potential infringer by seeing the article he cannot manufacture or copy that design you see in nil kamal share on nil kamal products easily we are using in the household items that they have mentioned in many design the article also the proprietor is a proprietor mentioned um register design number so it will helps to and the uh, infringement also our that is this design is already registered and uh, now coming to the post registration once it is registered what are the formalities and what are the requirements of register proprietor to be carried out during the term of the designs so here after registration design is published in the official journal and it is entered in register of design and any third party can inspect the design and request for search any any third person can search whether that particular design is available in uh, design register of design or not whether this type of design is registrable or already uh, available or not then extension copyright i discuss subsequent slides registration of last design certificate copy assignment alteration rectification correction of clerical error that is all post registration activities uh, one can carried out after registration yes at last the cancellation that means design of is registered in the designs depending upon the documents available to examiner that the internal database as well as any format of publication available in free internet internet so if the particular documents is not available during the search so any one after registration of design or publication of design and publication of the design once registered it will publish so during the tenure of the term of the design can of course in the form of cancellation i will what are the grounds i will discuss subsequent rights the extension of copyright what is the extension of copyright once it is registered it is valid for 10 years that means today if an application is filed and it is registered for for example today 15 july 2021 so it will be registered or then we are registering about one month if there is no objection or no or discrepancy all documents are in order it will be registered um the july application will be examined in august so by end of the august or september first week it will be registered notified in the journal and from today onwards he gets a right for 10 years that is 15th july 2031 so he need not pay and as as in today that is by paying 1000 if he is natural person or msme or startup he will get a right for 10 years by paying only 1000 rupees or if he is a institution like mizoram university or any um, industry so he will get also by paying 4000 rupees for 10 years so before expiry of the 10 years that is 15 july 2031 he has to renew if he wants for another 5 years in total design right is 15 years from date of application or date of priority prior to and letters i will discuss later um the so 15 years by paying um, by some amount of fees on by filing form 3 but if he fails to do suppose he forget he forgets he forgets to some uh, file the renewal form 3 along with prescribed fee before honor before 15 july 2031 so in that case there is a penalty provision he can revive his lapsed design by filing filing form 4 that is called a registration of lapsed design but there is a grace period of sorry uh, one year period from date of cessation uh, last of the design for example the 15 july 2031 is the due pay date to file a renewal for registration of a design 
but he fails to do so. In that case, he will get another one year, that is 15 July 2032, so that he can file by paying some extra fees in the form for the additional fees. That also very nominal, around 2,000 rupees only, if in natural, along with form 3. And then he uh, will uh, write a request to controller, that is the delay is unintentional and uh, that is due to undue delay. So it, the delay is condoned and can be restored. But during this period, one year, any he cannot take any legal action the against the infringer because he does not have the right unless it is restored. But for example, he forgets to, that also one year also lapsed, that is uh, uh, 11th year. For example, here, uh, 15th July 2032, that also lasts. So, after 15, 11 years, no remedy is there that it becomes public property. Any Anyone can use it here. And in that case, he cannot take any legal action. So, if he wants to renew, it depends upon the wish uh, of the research provider, then that must be submitted before the due date of first term on or before the expiry of 10th year or if he forgets he has to submit a registration a request for registration by filing form 4 that will also on or before expiry of the 12th year sorry 11th year then request for uh, information source uh, under section if there is a registration number is provided Suppose a design is registered, so uh, before filing a design, one can obtain a source report from design office by filing form 6 if it registered designs. Suppose a design, he want to file a design but does not know the registration number. So he also give a specimen or uh, representation, representation photograph of the article so that a design office can search for that party, for that applicant. So prior source in design office is available. For uh, registered designs as well as unregistered designs. And uh, yes, cancellation uh, regarding uh, like patents after grant of the patents, it has the uh, period of one year. So, post grant opposition, anyone can file third party or uh, interested person can file a post grant opposition for patents. But one year within the one year from date of grant of the patents. But here in designs, after this system design, once it is published, then will be published within uh, one week or uh, normally or 10 to 15 days we publish it. Then the, uh, fr from date of publication and during the total term, either 10 years or extendable to 15 years, another 5 to 15 years, anyone can oppose why under section 19 of the design chart. That is, if he has to file a petition of cancellation of registration design, inform it, and uh, the grounds of five grounds are there. It is not a new, the register design is not new or original. Register designs previously published or registered in India, either registered in India or published in India or any other country. And design is not to registerable under the act. That, that is, for example, icon, computer icon, computer graphics. At present, it is not a vendible product and uh, it cannot be um, appealed to I. And a, so it not qualifying section 2D and 2A of the Design Act. So it should not be registered, but it is registered. So in that case, he can, it is one of the ground for cancellation and not a uh, design, for example, uh, one uh, trademark item is, is is wrongly registered. It, it never happened. It will never happen for hypothetical situation. It or any computer uh, graphics register, but it is not a design under section 2D. So in that case, it is also one ground for this uh, not sorry cancellation of the particular design. Similarly, in religious items, for example, it should not be registered, but anyhow it is registered due to some uh, reasons. So it is in design one of the ground to cancel that design. So once it is a cancellation procedure um, completed and controller gives the decision, controller decision can be challenged before the high court. And uh, on the de um, decision of the control, uh, 
Honorable High Court. If it upheld the decision, then it will be cancelled. It is, and if it is uh, review and order the review the decision of the controller, then uh, it will be registered. If it, it will be cancelled, sorry, registered. Then uh, some development after the enactment of uh, 2000, Design Act 2000, modernization of design, this is our uh, implement of uh, design office, uh, 2002 to 2007, modernization design administration, generation of centralized design application number. That means earlier it was uh, suppose it file in Delhi, then uh, to get the number it takes, uh, it took most more time. Now once it is filed, you get centralized number. And 2008, designs publication started in Patent Office Journal. Prior to that, it was published in Gazette of India. And uh, it amendment of designs rules 2001 in 2008, it is being published. It started public publication in Office Journal that is being published on every Friday. 2009, online processing of design, uh, applic design application started. 2010, availability of online status. We are we, now. Online status is available in public in our website ipindia.nst.in. 2011, publication of Manual of Design and Practice. It is available in our public domain in our website. And 2014, online public search also available. Before filing, one can get search. I also our site also. In that, uh, one, once I complete my presentation. 2015, e-filing status. That is online filing. Along with offline mode, we introduce e-filing of design application. And 2016, issuance of online FR through emails. 2016 onwards, we are uh, issuing a first examination report, that is objection, first objection report to applicants if there is email provided by the applicant in form one. And simultaneously, we also follow, by, we also send the documents in by post because as the requirement of that. 2017 application of certificate copy through online mode. We can uh, we are giving encouraged applicant to file online mode and to get a certificate copy. 2018 issuance of hearing notice by email. We started uh, email hearing that we communicate hearing notice by email to the applicant. And 2019 India become the member of signatory of local agreement for the classification of industrial designs. And uh, in 2021, we have um, amended our uh, rule, Designs Amendment Rule 2021, incorporating local agreement as well as startup. 2020, to the, due to the COVID-19, uh, in uh, WIPO dashboard, provision proprietary documents has been introduced as well as hearing through on a telephone and video conferencing mode. The WIPO dashboard, that means already I discussed that the applicant, if he is, uh, for example, an applicant from USA, from American applicant. So he wants to file in India, in India. He has two options. He can file directly without taking in a priority from the US uh, patent office or design office. He can file, no problem. But he, if he files an application in USA, USA uh, patent office, and he wants to protect novelty from that application, he has to file under section 44 of the Design Act that is reciprocal arrangement and conventional rule Paris, under con Paris Convention. He will get six months. So within six months, he has to file application in India. For example, if we uh, file an application today, that is 15 July 2021 at USA, then he needs to submit application uh, within six months from today, that is 15 July, uh, January 2022. So while he submit the application and the repayment sheet, he has to give uh, submit the uh, that the priority documents that submitted in USA. The US, U.S. Patent Office will certify the documents and uh, it transmit to Design Office in Kolkata. 
and in that case he has to either submit offline mode paper documents or if you mentioned wipo dashboard he has to, uh, uh, now on 16 country are using wipo dashboard and if you mention dashboard then uh, design office will uh, retrieve the documents from wipo side that is wipo means all individual property organization so he need not for that uh, dashboard if he provides that code he need not submit the paper documents and if he if does not mention the dashboard at the time of application his application uh, he need he has to submit the documents at the time of application or within 3 month from date of application for example if he submit application with wipo dashboard today then no problem he need not to submit paper documents but if he file application today without prior documents or dashboard so in that case he will fill up the time of 3 month from today that is 10th october 2021 so before this 3 month he has to submit the prior documents of uspto with a penalty that is some uh, extension of time and he will submit within october for example august first week submit then he will take one month extension and the second month second month extension and third month maximum he will get three month extension that means by before 15th october 2021 he has need to submit the documents or prior documents this is the already i discussed the paris convention that is uh, if the applicant is from foreign country and local agreements it is a classification system of industrial designs international classification system classification of industrial designs and india we a member of this local agreement um, signatory of local agreement in june 2019 and that it came into force september 2019 and the hex system of interest of industrial designs it is the international system of registration of industrial design but india is not member of, of this agreement till now and uh, once it is registered and uh, the register proprietor in designs act like patents does not directly mention a right of the proprietor but one right can be inherited from the section 22 of the designs act so section 22 says uh, states privacy of the register design that means if anybody infringes so what proprietor of the design design holder can do that is during existence of copyright in any design it shall not be lawful for any person for purpose of sale of any article in any class of articles in which the design is registered or the design or any fraudulent or obvious imitation thereof except with the license written consent of the register proprietor that means if the any infringer or third party uses sales or imports or publishes the documents without authorization or license of the register proprietor the register proprietor can file suit against him before the district judge and uh, this is just depending upon the situation he will uh, give the penalty 25000 rupees or it can be uh, maximum 50000 depending on the situation and this 25000 and 50000 that was in 2000 mentioned 2000 2000 when act was enacted and still it is continuing this is all about my presentation and uh, if any question thank you sir for your nice presentation uh, i think uh, all the participants uh, have got a uh, plentiful benefit uh, from your lecture indeed it was a nice lecture now we can take up the questions mm. uh, so pradhan sir ha uh, yes uh, there is a question from uh, participant that ki how can i search uh, for industrial design that have been already registered
there are two way one can uh, sort it by filing form a form 6 or form 7 or i am showing our website Sir, another question is also there. Uh, I'm, I'm saying one, one by one. One by one. one. Okay. So is it a um, visible? The screen is yes, visible. Sir. Yes, yes, sir. Sir. yes, sir. Visible. Yes, this is our website, and uh, okay, sir. For example, if you go to home page, there is a public search. If you go to home page, the design, uh, public search, the public search pattern, design, trademarks, GI. So one need to click the design. Then he has to write here, for example, bottle. He does not know application number. नहीं डिस्प्ले हो रहा है सर प्रधान सर कीवर्ड दोबारा डाल लीजिए हाँ तो ठीक ठीक It takes time. Anyway, either uh, one can search our website that is available in ipindia.nic.in, then uh, go to the public search, public search in designs, and there, this is, uh, uh, if you click it, name of the article, because uh, design number one may or may not know, may not know the name of article, the equal to or bottle, then click it with a captcha, captcha code, and a get source. So one can get some idea, get some uh, information. Whether it is existing or not. Otherwise, if it is, the applicant does not know uh, the design number. So in that case, he need to submit form seven. Form seven under rule on, under section eighteen. Sorry, section nine eighteen. So in that case, the design official will search search for him and will give the report. And if the applicant knows that particular design and design number, in that case, he has need to sub submit a design number with the form six with a design number with a photograph. So in that case, after design official search for him and we will give, give the report. But for that, he has need to submit some fees. Fee is very nominal. It is around five uh, hundred, I think so.
form 6 yes 500 rupees for natural person and if other other than natural and natural person it is 2000 rupees similarly form 7 form 7 if it is design number is not supplied or not uh, known so in that case 1000 rupees for natural person msm and startup and 4000 for others otherwise you see so many bottles have come so one he can uh, compare his bottle for example he uh, want to file a application with the bottle design a bottle so he can search it so many around uh, 149 uh, not no, 149 Two nine seven eight. Register designs. Designs, sir. Yes, yes. All are registered designs. So one can get it freely from our website. These uh, are around three thousand bottles registered. Uh, sir, one more thing, uh, sir. Uh, uh, just uh, uh, just like the uh, European Patent Office and uh, US Patent Office, there is a uh, global uh, platform for searching the patent application. uh is there any uh, uh, global platform for searching uh, the global designs yes wipo site wipo sites one can search it okay. uipo european union uh, intellectual property office uipo that deals with the uh, trademark and designs mm -hmm. there one can get it. and uk design one can get it and uh, in japan chinese korean that is in uh, that their language sometimes one may get, get i may not get Uh, sir uh, there is another question uh, is uh, is the industrial design protection granted in one country valid in every country throughout the world <laughs> that is a hex system of uh, industrial designs that is uh, india not member at, at present 74 countries are member of uh, uh, in hex agreement there are two system one is a uh, denmark act and is a, another one is a london act so Many countries before uh, Denmark 1999 Act, and there are uh, the formal requirements. That means once it is filed in the Hague, that is the uh, WIPO um, under Hague agreements, it is uh, applicable to all member countries. But only formal they check on formal requirements, forms, fees, this much only. And uh, the national office, for example, uh, Germany. Germany is a and the african interest to germany germany in germany examination test substantial examination test press substantial examination during substantial examination the design may get registered may not get registered for example in hypothetical situation india become member of the hag so so india case uh, okay, that uh, it is registered internationally but when, once it they uh, enters in india it will be examined as per the provisions of the indian design act and for example indian designs it does not qualify qualifying the requirements of design act so india will not register that design so in that case except india this country country it will be prevail but it will not be um, not, not be uh, right not be upheld well in the territory of india Okay, sir. Pradhan sir, uh, one more thing. Uh, suppose uh, just like the patent application, uh, one can file as a conventional application and PCT application. So, in design case also, uh, this is the possibility there. Yes, there is a possibility. If there is a uh, India not member of HEC agreement, uh, so at present there is no scope for uh, international registration for Indian applicant. But if they can file it without taking pride from India. Okay, but, but India, means, they cannot enter to India. They need to submit an application in India, and separately they can file an international in IP under the agreement. If somebody so wants, uh, to, sir, if somebody wants to take the priority uh, from the India, he can do that. Oh, India not member of the agreement. Okay, so okay. It means uh, the, the date on which it has been filed in any country will be considered as the date of filing. Yes. So if he uh, that. For example, uh, USA. USA recently joined 2016, I think. He joined the Hague Agreement. If the US applicant files an application in USA, U USA, he has two options. Either he can file application application uh, in the USA, then USPTO will forward the application to a uh, WIPO, or 
US applicant files an application in USA. Subsequently, a file application in uh, WIPO by taking okay. priority from USA. Okay, that sir. he can do it. But for okay. Indian applicant, at present, India not member. So he will not get any uh, type of relief from the Hague Agreement. Okay, okay. Sir, uh, just for out of uh, this uh, course of question, sir, uh, what is the difficulty in become, becoming the uh, this member of Hague? Uh, uh difficulty you see that there are the policy issue okay so sir. policy issue, okay so i will not discuss all the details just here <laughs> okay okay sir so it's a policy issue government um you take the open number stakeholder right i will not comment on that okay uh, so dipto sir any question from your side abhijyoti okay, no sir no question for <laughs> no question sir lali sir I think there are a few more uh, little simpler questions are there if you can take it up. Yes, yes, no problem. Abhijyoti, there are a few questions are there. Please see. Tell me. Sir, uh, Lali, sir, I have actually put up all the questions one by one. I think most of the questions I have covered. I think still some are this one. Ah, please continue. No problem. Please ask. Uh, please ask. Uh, Pradhan sir. Pradhan sir. Uh, yes. th uh, there is a question. Is it mandatory to make an article by industrial process before making an application for a, a registration? No. Uh, you see, in section 2D, that in uh, designs, if you if it be manually, that the article can be, uh, for example, uh, any bamboo items from Tripura, because Tripura, uh, they are making the articles of mangoes, uh, sorry, bamboos, and as, as well as uh, some uh, that is cane, cane sofa. So that can also be, it not necessarily industrially. But it can be manipulated by manually. So that can be registered. And even if it is a concept, suppose you have not manufactured, but you have the uh, concept that I will design the, that article for sofa or uh, one more uh, box, you can say. Uh, they are carrying a uh, lonton, for example, rural India they are using lonton, which is made up of bamboos. So he is the idea, but he has not translated into product. So in that case also, he can uh, depict, but what he, he keep in mind, he has present in a paper. And he can uh, submit in design office by writing this specific format that I have already discussed. You can file it, no problem. Concept can be, uh, uh, concept in the form of article, though it is not manufactured. Uh, Pradhan sir, there is a question, a very similar question which you have answered earlier. Uh, is it possible to product industrial design which is registered only in India if someone from other country use this? No, in a section 4B already discussed is that India either pub public uh, prior pub use or prior publish. In India or in elsewhere, India considered absolute novelty. So absolute novelty means any part of the world. Some country have the territorial novelty, uh, but we consider it as absolute, absolute novelty. Any part of the world, it, if, if it is available prior to filing, either use for prior use or prior publication. So it, can, it uh, lacks novelty. Sir, there is another question. Can I register and use a logo from an expired registered trademark or design mark? No. Denmark, in the design section 2D, yeah, while I um, discuss that is three parts, three, though it is uh, mentioned one paragraph, but the, the three part. First is definition of design, then uh, apply to article by different process. The definition of design is already discussed, that is shape, configuration, surface pattern, color ornamentation, color combination. Then second part is apply to article. How it is applied? By manually chemically, 
um, then uh, mechanically. So this way one can be applied to article. So article, what is article? It can be made and sold separately. No, sorry, uh, the article, it is the uh, manufacturer, uh, articular manufacturer, artificial, or partly artificial, partly natural. So then uh, there he has, to, he has to give, uh, and that article should be legible to us. This is sugar uh, cube and uh, grain of sugar, my example, the Khata. And uh, there, while he is claiming, he has to disclaim trademark, make a mechanical aspect, functionality disclaim, and letter words, numbers under copyright act, property mark. It's for disclaim. So once you want to disclaim, trademark has to be disclaimed. That is under trademark act, not design act. Okay. Sir, uh, how many times design protection can be extended? Only once, 10 plus 5. Okay, uh, okay, years. sir. Uh, sir, in case of violation of any uh, design uh, uh, protection, uh, what is the remedy, sir? Remedy, you can file uh, in district court. That is under section 22, uh, piracy of design. That uh, on authorized use, use of that article. So, anywhere or any other, uh, sorry, district proprietor can file a suit in district court. It is. Uh, it must be filed in district court, sir. Uh, not uh, below district court. Okay, okay. Uh, so unlike the uh, patent infringement, which is filed in uh, high court, no, sir. No, here district court. I think patent also district court. Uh, high court, he can file. No problem. But not below then uh, district court. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Okay. Sir. Higher form, can file. It's no problem. Okay, sir. Uh, Lali sir, I think uh, we have covered yes, yes, yes. Uh, most yeah, yeah. of the questions. Yes, yes. We have covered uh, most of the questions. Uh, yeah, thank you. Yeah. So now Actually, th th there is a question related to trademark infringement, but uh, I don't think, he, uh, sir, uh, you have any idea how we can uh, protect the infringement of trademark? Trademark, uh, no, I don't have idea because uh, uh, in the generalized uh, statement, I should not give because. Yes, yes. Uh, actually, uh, see, uh, for the uh, participant, uh, see, uh, this, this this seminar is only about the uh, patent and design. We are, fo we, uh, we are uh, focused on uh, patents and design. Mm. So next time when we, uh, we will have some expert on the trademark uh, office, I think he or she will be uh, able to answer your question properly. Now, another thing that uh, Dr. Premnath, if he, he wants to answer, then he, he asks ask him to uh, write an email to me so that uh, I'll consult our trademark of people and they will reply. Okay, okay. It will be better the, uh, because uh, they are uh, telling me that application. Um, trademark okay, related application, the, they will give better answer. Okay, okay. For the participant, if you feel uh, it necessary to get the answer, then you write email to Pradhan, sir. Sir, your email is available on the website of the patent officer. Yes, it's that contact. Go to the contact. That is controller design. But in my personal email ID, you can give it jkprozan.ipo at the date nic.in. Or okay, controller sir. design. Or controller design.ipo at the date nic.in. Controller design is available in the contact address. Okay, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, but uh, in the last, uh, but not least, I hope uh, this is seminar will uh, because we are uh, now around 30 to 40 percent. One paper I have actually just uh, take. Yes, yes. The state wise, actually, I am emphasizing that the uh, northeast, northeast uh, filing of design application. Uh, not uh, remarkable. The last 10 years, only 100 cases, around 100 cases we have received. Out of which, uh, even if after filing, they are not responding. Responding when the office sends uh, objection letter, that communication letter, or some discrepancy, they are not submitting. So I hope uh, Mizoram uh, second position in the Northeast in terms of filing. And uh, I hope the Mizoram University will take the lead, but in a uh, so that more design application can be filed from the Mizoram and particular Mizoram University. 
because they uh, are academics and uh, in other institutions play a great role to encourage and innovate the product as a design design is very simple even if it is not patents for design one can file it yes similarly uh, similarly you united ke sorry um uttarakhand uttarakhand though it is filed but not significant like western uh, uh, states of our country because we are uh, last even if in spite of uh, pandemic our filing is going on increasing around 30% 30% increase so if not the eastern belt still lagging behind and particular north is still lagging behind yes sir yes sir that's why sir we need such kind of the seminar frequently uh, to have more awareness and uh, uh, to get motivation to the all the academicians in the institutes level mm. so sir it is uh, very nice uh, to hear from the both the, our experts uh, which will give in depth knowledge about the from right from the processing of filings and the designs so and the, not only this one uh because uh, many of the people are not aware about the particularly the process uh, because the process is not uh, as uh, like familiar with the submitting a research paper in a journal so process uh, we have to have deep knowledge and the understandings so by conducting such kind of the seminars and the awareness uh, we hope in future uh, there will be definitely there will be an increase in the number of petal filing and the interest will be uh, motivated to the people and the researchers and research scholar and the faculty members uh, so uh, this is uh, so uh, in future also sir uh, we will surely uh, seek your uh, help to conduct uh, further uh, the seminars regularly interval so that the, the the new generation can be keep on motivating the things suppose today some of the uh, the participant may have some certain doubts they may not be able to first time who are attending they they need some certain time to understand the things then once they really want to start doing the things and the one start giving the interest then the, uh, they will know that what are the exactly the things what to be done so then after that the once if we do conducting the such kind of seminar in the regular interval then the more clarities and the more confidence will come to the people uh, so that the we can do more filing we remember that when we were doing the research and all the things we were hardly bother about the filings of the patents uh, we just bother about the uh, to publish the paper in good uh, research paper with high impact factors that was the main concentration uh that was not much focus uh, ourselves in the this kind of the ipr and design so uh, but the the frequently conducting such kind of workshop will surely uh, have motivate and it will they will surely people will surely understand the importance of the this uh this iprs so now uh, the dr abhijyoti kindly take up and uh, give the word of thanks uh, thanks to the our honorable speaker dr j k pradhan sir yes, thank you sir so finally we have come to the at the end of our this one day seminar on ipr and its related issues and the in the first session also and in the second session the information we are we got it is a huge to us that that as lolis sir said that we are as academician we are mainly concentrating on publishing the paper in the good journal and sir also knows that in last 2 3 years we are also working in that particular way that is after uh, designing a particular structure we are trying to patent it because the, I, what i think that it is a lack of knowledge that uh, and once we think about patent patent means a huge thing to us means uh, actually we don't do not bother to make it patent so definitely this workshop i think all the participant will agree with me that it will be helpful for us it will motivate us to uh, file the patent at least we can file the patent let the other process go on as usual we don't know many things we had we used to think that it is very simple but it is not that much simple in the in the in that technology so i 
Thank you, sir, uh, Dr. J.K. Pradhan, sir, that in spite of your busy schedule, you give us so many, so much time and explain all the thing from the root level, grassroots level, and hope the participant will surely uh, motivate it from your talk and they will surely uh, file more and more patent. And hopefully from the Northeast, as you told that it is very less number of patent we are fi filing, Hopefully in the near future, we'll file more and more patent. Thank you very much, sir. Sir, you are muted. Pradhan, sir, you are muted. Oh, oh, sorry. Now, for designs, one checklist is available in our websites. That is very simple format, one page format I mentioned. And you can also uh, ask the participant to see that what a document to be required. So go to the checklist, one page checklist one. And uh, one more thing I should uh, add this one. A, uh, patent office, any patent office in India, uh, always ready to help the applicant. So if you have any type of doubt, any type of query, uh, how to file design application, uh, how to file uh, patent application, please contact any official uh, from the patent office as we have to, uh, today int uh, interaction with the uh, Dr. Sudip sir and uh, Pradhan sir. So anyone can uh, conduct, uh, contact this uh, resource person for uh, any doubt, any help, okay? So please, uh, I request everyone come forward and uh, whatever you have in your mind, in a, maybe patent, maybe design application, so come forward and file your application to the patent offices. Dr. Avijyoti. Yes, sir. So with this, we'll start our validatory session. So, uh, uh, oh, sir, Pradhan, sir, sir, uh, uh, you, sir, if you wish also, you can uh, leave and you can continue to work. And th thank you very much, sir. You have spent uh, lots of time with us. Uh, we should uh, give a uh, get gratitude to you for your valuable times and then sparing with us and you're explaining the, all the things. Uh, now I will be uh, touch with you, sir, uh, now I, uh, through phone and uh, this one. Uh, okay. Uh, thank you very much, sir. Uh, thank you. <laughs> thank, you sir. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, Avjyoti, it's up to you. Just... Uh, yes. So... Share the uh, link, I think feedback link and other things. Yes, I, I am sharing, sir. I am sharing in the chat box. So all the participant, you are requested to see the chat box. There is a Google form. So you have to fill up the form and certificate will be gener generated and it will be given to your mail, registered mail ID. That mail ID that you are giving at the time of filling up the feedback, not the registered mail ID that is you have registered for this particular is a session, not it is a Zoom session, not that one. The uh, while filling the form, the email ID, that email ID, you will get your certificate. So the form has been shared in the uh, chat box. Just see and try to fill up the form. And and from the participant, if anybody can share their experience regarding today's today's that one national seminar on IPR and related issues. You can just raise your hand. We'll make you. We'll keep uh, yeah, bring you in the panelist list, and you can say some words. Uh, yes. Uh, first, uh, please fill up the Google form uh, because uh, uh, it is also essential to have the e certificate. Uh, then after that, uh, we will have uh, some certain uh, kind of the interactions. If any of the, our participants, their participants, if they wish to give some kind of the suggestions to us. It is always welcome. Uh, in future, if we conduct any kind of the IPR related workshop, we can always have uh, some certain improvements and uh, we can even extend, uh, we can think if required, instead of one day, we can think of uh, uh, two days uh, so that we can have covered uh, the more areas. 
so that kind of the things can be always be done uh, so uh, so first you please fill up the google form then after that the, we will uh, uh, try to uh, incorporate the, this thing uh, uh, take up the uh, uh, try to take the, some uh, your suggestions and all those things like that Okay, if anybody who want to give uh, suggestions and all those things, you can raise your hands, then uh, we can promote you. And then after that, uh, you can mm, say, or if you want, if you want to speak something, then also you can be always welcome. Uh, Dr. Tripti Negi is... Dr. Tripti Negi? Sir. I think I've been promoted. Have... So you, if you wish, you can say. Dr. Tripti Negi, you raise your hand. Uh, you wish to say some few words. Okay. Otherwise, uh, Nagesa Nag Rao B. I think uh, uh, Moral wants to say something, sir. He is yeah, yeah, one by one, we will promote. Okay, sir. Okay. Uh, now is a Nagesa Rao B. Oh, yes. to all the regulators. Uh, it's very nice session. Uh, first of all, my dear from Vignans uh, Foundation for Science, Technology and Deemed to be University of Andhra Pradesh, Vijayawada, okay. is Guntur district. Uh, my party greetings to our Honorable Vice Chancellor, Ram sir. And the session uh, is very nicely organized. That's what I can say. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, yeah, about myself also, Professor and Director for Innovations and Entrepreneurship Cell of this university. And uh, the combination of the resource person is quite good. Uh, yeah, of course, the uh, little more thing uh, to be covered, in fact, uh, it's not out. Uh, also, we have, uh, I think it's the um, uh, first uh, time I just joined in this webinar of your university. I don't know. Uh, what sort of uh, seminars so far you have organized? Uh, also, the resource persons from IPO uh, background is also maybe helpful to the participants uh, sometimes. This is what uh, I found uh, regarding the resource persons. And uh, whoever uh, they have agreed and they did their best, I know. Uh, this is from my side. Uh, uh, really, the way you conducted is very good. The time, your time management and your punctuality, all these things are really good. That's all. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Yeah, in future, definitely, uh, we keep in touch with you. Uh, we can share some words from you also. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank uh, one thing I want to ask that we have sent already a few certificates. So anybody got the certificate? Uh, you can say yes or no in the chat box. Okay. Yes, yeah, some say they got the certificate. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, thank you for your feedback. So uh, once you fill up the uh, feedback form, definitely you will get the certificate and if you have any means any correction in the certificate just you can mail to us any one of us at the same at the same mail id from where you are getting your certificate uh, sir uh, moral uh, pu moral is uh, actually uh, raising hand wants to say something sir please promote him yeah i have already promoted Promote to panel list is already done. We'll be joining webinar as a panel list. Yeah, I have already promoted. 
uh, okay any yeah, uh, anybody uh-huh. else yes yeah anybody who wish uh, if any suggestions are there or or uh, we can promote may you please raise your hand then uh, we can hello yes uh, for more and we can hear oh, oh okay 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 sir thank you thank you give uh, thank you for giving me a chance actually sir uh, my network was down i could not join in the afternoon i mean the last uh, th- around 30 minutes i wanted to ask like uh, patent search the the first uh, resource person mentioned about patent search so can we perform uh, by ourselves say uh, like uh, we have uh, some idea then we have some product also that idea is already there it's already patented or not if we go for some agency they can they say they can perform uh, patent search also but is it possible Uh, so that we will have more confident also if we get the result beforehand before we proceed so is it a chance of doing potentials by yourself that yeah. is my question sir yeah uh, pu moral actually uh, 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 there is a uh, different sites provided by different uh, patent office throughout the world uh, even in india we have our uh, own patent office that is uh, a website that is ipoindia.nic.in on which you can go and uh, you can uh, search the your uh, content as per your field yeah. and even the european patent office uh, you can follow uh, to search uh, throughout the uh, all patent application throughout the world and uh, us patent office also so as per uh, your requirement as for your choice as for your uh, see a uh, field you can search you go to the uh, patent office search option and you can search give some keywords and uh, after that you will get some result and you can uh, go through those patent apli- applications what what are the details of those applications so this is available okay and, okay uh, it is beneficial uh, see if somebody is Uh, writing some uh, patent application so it is very much beneficial to uh, that person before uh, filing the patent application he can realize what is uh, what has been done and how can uh, how he can write the patent application so it is very useful to search before filing any application okay okay thank you thank you so much uh, yeah so actually the pradhan sir also have shown some certain design like the bottle how to search the bottle and to check uh the different kind but the, it was the design one the similarly for the others also uh, similarly sir on the same right. website there is a trademark uh, right. and there is patent search yes yes, yes. So all these are available on the yes. uh, indian patent office website also yes, yes. Hmm. uh but but the, what the pradhan sir also have just mentioned uh, or you also have just mentioned like uh the, you we have to search to the other the patent site also because uh, Uh, whatever we search in the india uh, it may, um, all the which is in the other country may not be available here so this is particularly for india so because when we got the examination report then the, uh, we used to get the similarity from the us patent chinese patent japanese patent even yes, some french patents like that so uh, we also have to search from the other uh, this one and even the pradhan sir was also suggesting that the india he's yet to join in that kind of the consortium uh, so that uh, after joining with the consortium the things will be uh, more visible and a more improvement in the search also i hope so mm, uh, actually sir uh, the, uh, de- for design only uh, india has not signed the hague uh, uh, regulation that uh, but for patent india is already signatory of the pct and uh, mm-hmm. see uh, I uh, generally uh, when it comes to the uh, patent search I prefer European patent office search because they are providing very uh, huge uh, database throughout uh, the world whatever the application file uh, even in uh, Japan even in China even in European country even in US even in India they are providing all those application in one uh, on one platform Mm. so it's better to search there uh, in european patent office yes, yes. and similar database has been provided by uh, the us patent office also yeah, so yeah. any patent office i prefer uh, european patent office but you can follow any patent office they are providing uh, all the database throughout the world uh, on one platform mm. 
Yes, uh, um, uh, for your kind information to uh, many of the, our participants, uh, Dr. Premnadji is also uh, working in the IPO office, I, uh, the patent officer for almost uh, more than 10 years, uh, almost uh, 10 years there. Uh, before joining, coming back to the academic, <laughs> so he is also having good knowledge. Uh, uh, with uh, so it is good to be with uh, him also. Um, is there any more uh, suggestions or any questions are there? Uh, uh, so many are raising the questions for particularly for the feedback form. Yes, uh, uh, it will be suppose if you have fill up the feedback form successfully, uh, you will get the certificate. Uh, no need to be worried. Uh, if you don't get it also, uh, uh, the, our emails were provided. Uh, so if any of the email you can contact uh, or you can contact to the uh, Dr. Avizoti also, uh, you can contact if you if you have fill up successfully, if you don't uh, get it, but uh, uh, please wait uh, for some time. Uh, you, you will surely get the uh, e-certificate if you have fill up the uh, feedback form successfully. Okay. So once, uh, once again, I request uh, pe, uh, all the participants, if uh, anyone wants to say something, even a student, uh, so many students are participated today. So yeah, exactly. if you are, uh, if you want to say something, yeah, if you have any uh, right. uh, query, then we can entertain that. We can uh, uh, actually put up on the, this platform to uh, this your query or any question from your side. Anyone? From the student side, yeah, even uh, faculty, yeah, any uh, people who has joined today. Yeah, next time uh, uh, we will also like uh, what the one speaker from the Bijagora who uh, Bijag, uh, this one also mentioned that uh, like yes, still the contents need to be covered more. Yes, definitely because of the time constraint and number of the resource person. Are limited. We have put limited to two per two, uh, and maybe in future, if we have get the chances, then we will surely try to improve the number of the experts. And then not only this one, uh, we can also think like uh, we have many academicians uh, who are having 50, 60 patents uh, who have very well experience uh, while uh, while filing the patents and all those things. Uh, we can see what they experience uh, also, that kind of the things. Uh, we can contact some people uh, there who has been the large number of patents, uh, Indian, uh, who are in abroad also and who is having more than 60, 70 patents are there. So that kind of the people also, we can uh, try to get it so that uh, they are experienced while doing the processing of the patents uh, uh, that can be also be uh, incorporated as a resource person. Yes, definitely uh, long back, people used to say that uh, the process of filings and all those things is a long time taking process. But uh, today, uh, the, our experts uh, has already said uh, within 18 months, it will be published. Uh, now, now the, all the scanning, all the, 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 the systems has been fully computerized. So many of the things has already improved as compared with the those in the late, uh, the long back. So, uh, so the, it will surely encourage the researchers and the faculty members and the students uh, for going for the patents and all those things like people as also even uh, it, the suggestions were given by the, our resource person that even uh, your technology, which is going to be absolute, maybe uh, in the uh, in the next year or something like that, if the research is very actively be doing in everywhere in the world, uh, there are the way where uh, you can uh, the proceed in a faster way. Th those the, the, all the provisions has been discussed by the all the board, the, our resource person uh, who has been doing all these kind of the things. Uh, okay, they have highlighted very clearly. So so it is we should not be feel very scared of uh, filing, and we should come forward as. A, as also it is also said that even we have the participant from the various uh, part of the country uh, so the it has already this, uh, divided into the different zone even if it, it is decided to the different zone uh, they are always welcome to contact uh, to the even if you are from the different part of the either from the central india or from the, the southern india if you contact with them also even they are from the eastern region uh, kolkata uh, they will be definitely uh, reply it 
because the process in the eastern region or whether it is in the, uh, the central region the process is the same in throughout the india uh, what the things has been going on so they any of them uh, whether you are mailing to the kolkata region or whether you are mailing to chennai or whether you are mailing to the mumbai or the the delhi so the, uh, they will surely they, all the process are same so any of the office can take care it only thing is that the file uh, filing only it has to be done only with the your uh, the jurisdiction where the your that you are belong that is the only thing uh, so sir uh, yes. one more thing i think uh, mr yes. mustafa kamal is asking is it possible please conduct online workshop of ipr patent under iz and nip nagpur which is free see uh, mr uh, mustafa i would like to explain these things even in nagpur uh, this uh, this is a training center for uh, I, on ipr and uh, the resource persons which are going to this uh, Nagpur Training Center is from the all patent offices, four patent offices, uh, including the trademark offices and the I offices. So they are uh, the resource person, and uh, even it is our uh, as a university, as a central university, it's our responsibility also to uh, conduct such type of program to make the uh, students, make the researcher more aware of these facts. That uh, please come forward to file the patent application, design application. Uh, it's very uh, fine. You are filing. You are, uh, you are uh, submitting your research paper for your application in the international journal and national journal. But at the same time, we are also conducting this type of seminar to just encourage the researcher to file the patent application and design application. And uh, uh, today, as you um, uh, notice that uh, the two resource persons uh, who were actually conducting this session from the uh, patent office, Kolkata. They they are at very uh, senior position, so it's uh, in the same line. Whatever the IZ, uh, NINP, and Nagpur is conducting and doing things, okay. So it's not uh, different with, uh, where we are not conducting with the help of IZ, NIP, or we are conducting individually. It's on the same track. We are conducting the same type of awareness program. And uh, one more thing, uh, somebody has asked that. Uh, can you tell me how can I get the information of the future webinar or lecture session? See, such type of a webinar, when we are going to organize, uh, it will be given uh, on the website. It will be uh, circulated through the social media also. So uh, whenever uh, we will organize it, uh, we'll just inform through the social media, through our website also. So just keep on watching the websites. So uh, as per my record, those who have already filled up, around 60 participants have filled up the form and we have distributed all 60 um, uh, certificate to them. So there is no more entry. Uh, so as you fill up the form, automatically the certificate will be generated and given to your uh, registered email ID. Don't, don't worry about it. Uh, so if there is no any or uh, suggestion, yes, uh, many of the suggestions has been coming up that uh, we will also take care. And uh, from our side also, uh, uh, many of the things has already been clarified. Uh, yeah, yeah, surely uh, we will also be looking forward uh, for conducting uh, such uh, workshops and all those things uh, which will surely uh, promote to the uh, researchers and uh, our uh, the new faculty members uh, who have been doing actively the research and all those things like that, uh, research. So this this will surely help uh, all of us uh, for the improving the, our uh, because uh, as we know that uh, yeah, like uh, even if uh, we the patents are granted, it will be a credit to the. Uh, faculty members or the, the students uh, who has filed the patent. So there is a, always, but uh, the advantages are there. Uh, so we, uh, with this note, uh, uh, if we don't have any more suggestions and all those things, uh, 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 then the, we can come to the end of the, the sessions uh, with the valid victory note. Uh, 
Uh, sir, uh, one more thing regarding the sharing of PPT. Uh, uh, we have requested the uh, resource person to share, and uh, when we will get that, uh, we'll uh, make it available on the website. So mm -hmm. those who are interested in getting this PPT and uh, uh, this, so we'll share uh, this PPT on uh, our website, maybe Mizoram University or maybe HNB Garhwal University, uh, possibly at, at the Mizoram University. So just uh, keep watching on that. Okay, we'll uh, see yeah. uh, Doctor Pranav, just so one one thing. Uh, like uh, we have, as yes, they have registered through uh, the, our Zoom, uh, so the, their emails are there. So what we can do is that we also have an uh, automatic recording systems for the those attendees. So among those attendees, uh, we can uh, have the emails and uh, we can share the this video link also, uh, or the, if PPTs are not uh, available, then the, the video links of the whole sessions uh, can be shared. Okay, sir. Uh, okay, sir. Also through there, this one. So uh, we we are been doing uh, this one uh, for many of the webinars and all the things. Uh, so please uh, not to be worried. Uh, if you are interested, uh, if you, as you have been coming forward, uh, to have a more interest on the, this one. So we will, uh, if the PPTs are not available, the recording video sessions, uh, which are available in YouTube, the links uh, we can provide it through your, uh, the register email. Okay, uh, we have the automatic recordings of the attendance from among those attended persons, uh, we can share the, uh, the video link. So it is not a big issue. Okay, okay sir. Sir, uh, one uh, participant, Deepak Singh Nizwala, he's raising his hand, I think. Okay. This, this, um, Deepak Singh Nizwala. Deepak Singh. He's the first on the participant list, sir. Yeah, yeah. I, I already promoted. He, this one, this one. Yes, Deepak Singh Nizwala, you can speak. I think there is some issue. I think he's not up level in the. Okay. okay, sir. Okay, then. The, uh, so, uh, Abhijyoti, so let us uh, formally give the uh, board of thanks uh, for the final conclusions of the uh, our okay. today's seminar. So, the program. So formal vote of thanks. I would like to thank Mizoram University as well as Asian Big Garwal University for giving us the chance to organize this uh, one day seminar on IPR. Um, and I would like to thank uh, our coordinator, uh, Professor L. Lolit Kumar Singh, sir, Dean School of Engineering Technology, Mizoram University, program joint co coordinator, and Dr. Premna sir from HNB Garwal University, Professor S. sir, and I want to thank the participant that because of you, this program has become successful. And as I have seen the different suggestions from your side, different participants, participant side, that please extend this program in one week program or two days program or three days program. Definitely we'll keep it in my, our mind and we'll try to uh, arrange a workshop on this IPR because many things we come to know that only publishing the good paper in a good impact factor journal is nowadays is, is not sufficient. You have to keep right on your, on your own work in your name. Anyway, and uh, I would like to thank uh, our eminent uh, speaker, Dr. Sudip Jyoti Shauzer and Dr. J.K. Pradhan sir from IPO Kolkata, despite of their busy schedule, they have agreed to give a detailed discussion, detailed presentation on a, from grassroots level that how to file a patent and what is the importance of filing the patent. And at the last, I would like to thank all the participants for joining us. 
Thank you very much. Thank okay. you, Vijayake. I think. Yeah. Uh, thank you to all. So, okay, we will uh, officially we close the session. Thank you to all. Uh, so now we will close it. Session. Okay. Thank, thank you, you Karnadi. Uh, thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, I think uh, it's uh, more than uh, uh, satisfactory what we have done today, sir. Yeah, I see. Yeah. 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 And so many participants, so many uh, students, researcher, faculty have joined. Yeah. Um, it's it's very good to think some faculty from the uh, middle India and uh, maybe the south they have joined. Also have joined. Very good. Yeah. Yeah. So say, nice. sir, 60, 62 people have filled up the form and all the certificate has been distributed to them. Uh, 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 once again, I would like to request all the participants to fill up the uh, this PDF, uh, feedback form. And uh, then after you will get the cert e certificate. So in case of any problem, they will, I think, uh, either contact us through email or maybe any other means. Okay. Our, our emails were available in our browser also, uh, that flyer also. To mm. this, you can contact it. Okay. Oh, okay, sir. Okay, uh, thank you. Very okay, much. then uh, we will uh, close the session. Thank you very much. To all. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay. Bye.